Hi, this is Heidi from Garden Crossings and I wanted to kind of show you this colorful corner here in my garden and just talk about some of the things we have blooming. It's mid-July right now and in this little location, what I've done is I have taken a ton of different cone flowers and planted them so that I get kind of a mixture of colors going on. Uh, you can see in the very back, there's like a deep magenta that's Pow Wow Wildberry. And we've got this beautiful pink, which is Purple Emperor. And then in this little cluster here, we've got Frankly Scarlet, some more Purple Emperor, some Price is White. There's also some yellow in there, which is Yellow My Darling. And down in the bottom there is some of the Baja, um, I think it's Baja Red in their little bit shorter habit. So that's, if, I don't know about you, but I just love to create a whole cluster with these cone flowers and mix all the different colors together. So if you're looking for a great pollinator garden, cone flowers definitely will bring the pollinators into the garden. I don't know if you can see the bees buzzing around, but they are just having a heyday here in this little spot. Also in this little area, we've put a few daylilies in there, some clematis and a little bit of petunia there just for some constant splash of color. So if you're looking for some pollinator plants to add to the garden, consider giving some coneflower a try. This is Heidi from Garden Crossings.